So my next problem is number four of the independent practice. This is also an extremely easy problem. All I have to do is square both sides. And when I do that, whatever is inside comes out. So I have 2p minus 45 equals p divided by 3. Now I'm going to multiply both sides by 3 to eliminate this denominator. And so this side gets, whoops, simplified to 1 and 1. And so we have p equals, I'm going to distribute this 3, so I have 6p minus, is that 45 times 3 is 135. I'm going to add 35 to both sides. So I have 6p equals p plus 135. I'm going to move this p to this side. So I have 5p equals 135. Divide both sides by 5. p equals 27. Okay, let's go ahead and check that work. The original equation was 2p minus 45 equals square root of p divided by 3. I'm going to put, I am going to substitute 27 for p equals square root of 27 divided by 3. So I have 2 times 27, which is 54 minus 45 equals square root of 27 over 3 is 9. That's 9. So square root of 9 or 3 does equal 3. So my answer is P equals 27. Good job.